Hey, Nubia. Good night, girl. How you doing? Hi, Dina. Good night, teacher. Good night. How do you feel today? Uh, excuse me, teacher. I I am still sick, mm. but but I am a, a little better. Oh, I'm so happy that you feel much better. Okay, that's okay. I'm so glad that you're here, Nubia. I'm so happy. You will be able to listen to the, today's class, which is going to be really fun. <laughs> Thank you so much for doing your effort, okay? You do your best. Yeah, I'm so happy. Yes, teacher, teacher I, I think um, I'm just going to listen to the okay. class. Absolutely. No problem. I do understand. That's okay, Nubia. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Jorjito, how are you? Hi, Jorjito, how are you? Hey. How was your weekend? It was fine. It was fine. Did you yeah. do something special? Um, no, I stayed at home. You stayed at home? But did you watch any interesting movie? I don't know. You saw any um, hobby? Yeah, I watched it. Uh, Netflix? Fast and Fast to Furious. Nine. Fast and Furious number three. Wow. Number nine. Oh, number, oh my God, really? Is there number nine already? Wow. Yep. Are you serious? Okay, my husband would love it. <laughs> I, I don't know why, but I'm not too fan of Fast and Furious. I don't know why. Maybe I haven't seen none of them, but my husband really likes it. And also my sister and my niece. So I should let them know so they can double check Oh, that's good. Okay. Did you prefer something like um like popcorn or soda? I don't know. Nah. Yeah. I made a, a popcorn. Popcorn, really? Which one? Yeah. The one that you put into the microwave or the one that you start from the beginning with the seeds? With the beginning. Uh, really? Nah. Uh, yeah. Oh my god, and the casserole. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Uh oh, -uh. did you add something to it like extra butter or cheese? I don't know. But butter, butter. cheese is the salt. Salt? Uh huh. Mmm, sounds delicious. What about beverage? Any Coca Cola? I don't know. Coke? No. Uh, it was lemonade. No. Juice. <laughs> what? Yeah, lemonade. Lemonade, yeah, really? Mm -hmm. Oh my God, all right, that's great. Having had that combination, you know, but it, it will be good. Oh, that's so happy. With ice cream, wait, with ice. Oh, with ice. Like frozen. Oh, really? Frozen lemonade? Mm, sounds really good. I should try it. That's good. <laughs> all right, so you love cooking. Not really? No, not really. <laughs> no, but, but you can cook some, <laughs> some things, right? Yeah, but yeah. I, the basic I not one. so good. I don't know. Oh, don't tell me. You know what? The best chefs are guys. I don't know why. <laughs> but, you, but you know what? But you like food. Yep. So what? it could be a really good challenge or a good goal, goal for you, I don't know, to like learn to cook something, right? I like to make coffee beverage. Oh, really? Oh, that's a good one. That's good. Yep. Why well, you see, you have your with, uh, expertise in area. Yeah, with oh, my, my mother. With your mama. Oh, that's good. So you live with your mama? Yep, I live with my parents. Hey, that's nice. I'm so happy that still, you still have your parents. I only have my mom. Okay. She doesn't live with me because she wants to be independent. Mm. And she prefers to live alone. Ah, but it, she's really happy when I arrive and also my pets. There's one of them that the, the little one, Chestnut. I don't know if you have seen it. I post a picture of me and my and one of my pets on the WhatsApp status. And um, she's like, he's a Bijon Matez. And my mom said, Chesna, would you like to go? And Chesna is like, no, I don't want to go. Every time that we arrive at my mom's house, he doesn't want to go. He wants to stay. And my mom said, I wish I could, I could stay with him. But the problem is that how am I going to get out to give him a walk, right? Because he needs to go 
outside to do his things, right? So, <laughs> but that's the problem. But my mama really loves him. And every time they arrive, they jump on her and she has to like sit on the sofa because it was like jumping and licking her and like, oh, like saying, hey, granny, right? Like that. Yeah, so she loves them. Every time she goes to the supermarket, she tries to find some food for them. They already have their own, I don't know, to towel for them. They have shampoo there. Oh my God, they have everything there. It would be like, it is, they are, they're her kids. Mm -hmm. Her kids, okay, my, my, I don't have kids, right? I don't have children, okay. but uh, my both, uh, my, my pets, are like mm -hmm. the grandsons for my mom. <laughs> so, mm -hmm. so she loves them by heart. You cannot imagine. And they love her too. She just recently came from Costa Rica. And uh, uh, before I went to the airport and pick her up with my husband, I told my husband, we got to leave the pets on my mom's house to prepare everything because once she arrives, you will see what will be the welcome that they're going to give it to her so uh okay we we have a we have like lunch and dinner with her because she has been a starving right she hasn't eaten anything during the trip so we had a dinner with her and after that we arrived to my mom's house and i said hey mom say say here because my husband has to turn in all the garage lights and everything and we gotta wait will be the same reaction so once they saw her oh my cat he has been like they haven't seen him for more than one year because my mama just spent just one month in Costa Rica but you cannot imagine how happy they were when they saw her and she's like oh, wait a minute and she brought them some swing caddies for him for them so they were really really happy and inside and jumping inside her luggage you know to look if they if my mama had brought her something special you, mm -hmm. did you understand what I said no, a little bit. Um, luggage, you know what luggage is? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So when my mom arrived, she opened the luggage mm -hmm. to, to give us the presents that she had brought us, right? The presents, the gift. And my dogs had jumped in into the, into the back. Entraron a la, a la maletas, right? Mm -hmm. To like smell and asking hey did, ma mama did you bring us something but any chance right because you know what yeah they're they are like kids when they stay here home and my husband and i uh, go out for something right to have lunch together or something a uh, every time that we arrive back home they are expecting that we brought them something yeah and what i what what they do is a jump under the sofa I open my bag, my wallet, and they put their noses inside. So they're like, so like, did you bring us something? Like candy or something? So every time that we go out to, to have something to, to dinner or for lunch, if it's meat, we just save some meat, some chicken, anything. So when we arrive, we give them their food, right? Their dark food. And we put something like to uh, start their appetite. And there's like, they start eating but they always wait something from us all the time they're like kids basically definitely and what not. kind of pet what kind of dog um i have a, um, a terrier with a schnauzer he's a daddy he's the eight years and uh chestnut is a baby but it's bigger than the daddy he's like one year and six months and he's a bijon maltese okay I'm going to send to you, to all of you, my pets. <laughs> and I have a little cat. Her name is Sassy. Today, they're like mm, a little bit down because they received the shots. <laughs> Today, they went to visit the vet to write to their, to get their shots, the vaccination and everything. So they're a little bit like under, right? But Sassy is okay. still recovery because uh, uh, they were supposed to have like an emogram. So they gave her Anastasia. And she's still like, Ooh, right? Like this, like dizzy. Yeah, because the cast has to be unnecessary. If not, you cannot do any tests for them. They're really like, right there. Mm -hmm. okay. It's different from dogs, yeah. They used to be here with me, but they left me. So 
Well, anyway. <laughs> hey, so it's not talking about me, guys. What about you? I have Carlitos Antonio, I have Alex, I have Dina, B, Rosio, Irving, Bree. Oh my God, how was your weekend, guys? Anything special? Oh, no, 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 no. Don't tell me that you did anything special. Come on. Good evening, no. teacher. Good evening, Bree. Good evening, T. Good evening, Carlitos. Mm -hmm. Bree, did you, did you um, sleep today from five until now? <laughs> I'm just asking. I'm just wondering. <laughs> Not today, teacher, because today. I have... I have a very, very busy day. <laughs> ah, okay. I forgot that today is not your day off, right? No. Uh, are they Fridays <laughs> or Thursdays? It was yesterday. Ah, okay. I'm sorry. Okay. No, I'm just wondering. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> yeah. No, I don't know. I just want to know, right? Yeah. But that's cool. Did you do something special on weekend? Like Antonio, that he watched a TV, a movie, and he prepared a popcorn. Um, no? not really. Nothing no, with not your really kid, no? Really. No. No. Uh, with my brother, he's coming in my home. <gasps> your brother. Ooh. Yes, he he lives in in San Juan on Alco. He in lives La Paz. in Alco. Oh, really? Ooh. Yes. It's pretty hot. He's there. coming with my home. Yay! Uh -huh. <laughs> That's great. A family day. <laughs> family day was good. good. Excellent. Yes. Oh, I'm so yes, happy. Was, I, I'm happy. <laughs> I am yeah, happy. Yeah, at least you have your brother here in El Salvador. I do not have my sister here. No, I'm living um, alone with my child. With your baby girl, yeah. Yes. But it's really All nice. my family living in San Juan. Oh, that's amazing. But they live here in El Salvador. Yes. Uh, <laughs> I wish my sister and my niece could be here with me because they live in Costa Rica. So for me, it's really hard to see them, right? Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. My mama have visited them recently, but I can't do to my job. I don't have vacations <laughs> right now. So I got to wait until next year around May, I think. Hopefully we'll have vacations by then. Hopefully. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Awful. <laughs> yes. No. Yeah, it's good. It's not good because um, since I do work for United States Enterprise, so that's the reason why. Well, but I will um. have next Monday <laughs> off. You know, ah, I'm so happy. Yeah, because next Monday, guys, it's gonna be the Labor Day in the United States. Oh. You know what Labor Day is? Labor. Dia del Trabajo. Labor Day. Oh. Labor. Yeah, 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 exactly. So next coming uh, Monday is going to be September the 6th. And that will be the Labor Day there. Like if here is May 1st, right? Labor Day. In El Salvador, Primero de Mayo, Dia del Trabajo, right? May. Yeah. Yes. But Michael. in the United States, no, it's um, uh, September the 6th. Mm. Ah, you got to know the holidays as well. Okay. It's really important that you know a little bit of culture. Yeah, so I'm, that means that next week is going to be a long weekend for me. Woohoo! I'm so happy about it. Yeah, finally. <laughs> you got to sleep. Eh, not really. <laughs> <laughs> no, you know what? I already, used, I already used to wake up really early. I know. Well, and I'm so happy that most of the time my husband prepared the, the breakfast. Because for yeah. me, it's really hard to wake up really early morning. But I have to. I, I don't know how the people Teach. make do it. <laughs> teacher, how teacher, yes, excuse Carlitos. me. No. How do, how do you how do you say uh, una esposa abnegada? An abnegated housewife. Yes, you are you are abnegated. <laughs> well, I'm trying to do my best. Yeah, because to, to me in the morning I pray for well, I make the brave, but no no prepare my wife. Ah, no, 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 no. come on no yes. my husband is really like, nice like, like the the uh, alex Hako, i started at 30 35 uh, in the morning so my my wife very very uh, sleep yes of course she deserves nah. it nah. <laughs> yes i don't know how how many many dreams in this in this moment <laughs> <laughs> yeah, imagine 5 30 a.m. Wow. What about yeah. you, Alex? Did you prefer your dinner, your dinner, your breakfast in the morning? Mm. Or not really? Did you prepare your your own breakfast? 
Oh, my breakfast. Um, mm -hmm. Coffee, yeah. only coffee and some cookie on um, Swiss, Swiss, Swiss Sweet bread. bread? Yeah. Ah, what about only, corn flake or anything? Jogger with fruits? No, nothing like that. No. <laughs> no. Nothing fancy? No. no. Oh, so that's nice for his wife because it's really easy, right? <laughs> yes, very easy. Yeah, that's great. Hey, guys, and talking about things that we like to do, uh, things that we like to eat, uh, do you remember what we, you used to like to do, to go or to play when you were like, ooh? child <laughs> i mean yesterday right <laughs> yeah do you remember that you you remember yeah, no, no, do you have your childhood ago. memories yeah yeah oh so you know what <laughs> today we're gonna talk about that and uh we're gonna learn something a new expression guys that we also can use when you talk about things in your past but this expression that we're gonna learn it is for something that, uh, or activities, behavior, places, or things that you used to do it. That means that something that it was in your, in your childhood days, but now that you already have grown up, you don't do it anymore. For example, uh -huh. for example, in the, uh, I use, uh, when I try, I used to adjust. Because yeah, you used to very yeah, good, just, yeah. I just to uh, hot, and and the uh, today no, I just hot. <laughs> ah, so you used to wear, wear. No, no, no uh, sombrero. Yeah, wear. You used to wear, wear hats. Okay, I, yes, because oh. my father, my father. Uh, this is the the how do you say it? the moda <laughs> for the the kids. Uh, yeah, uh, the, that was uh, a fashion the, style. Yeah, in yeah, those days. Oh, okay, it was a part of fashion. Good. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna show you right now something because if, if we want to talk about our childhood memories, it's really important also to have a, a little bit of vocabulary, right, to help us. So what I'm gonna share with you right now, guys, is gonna be like four things, four like big uh, scenarios. And we're going to try to find, and I will show you vocabulary, okay? And I want you guys to help me put the vocabulary in the correct place, okay? Do you understand what I'm go we're going to do right now? Yep. Okay, so yes. Let me yes. All righty. All right. So do me a favor. All right. Let me check what I have it here. There you go. It's here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let me share right now my screen with them. There you go. Okay. Hey, how, how have you changed? That is our topic today. Hey guys, and you see, we have our childhood memories here in the, in the middle and we have pets, hobbies, possessions, and places. So may I ask you guys, uh -uh. let's talk about this one, the first one. Beach, it, beach. is it a hobbies, a pets, a places, or possessions? In which category? Places. Exactly. Places. What about cat? Uh, pet. Pet. Yes. pet. Of course. So cat is here. All righty. We're going to put capital letter here. There you go. Okay. What yeah. about col collect comic books? What is that? Possessions. It could be possession mm. or it could be uh, hobbies. What do you think? Hobbies. Hobby. Hobbies, mm. yes, because hobbies. we collect. Yes. Exactly, mm -hmm. very good. So this one is gonna be hobbies, right? Okay, it will yeah. be collect comic books. All right, that's good. Mm -hmm. What about guys, um, crudgeons? Uh, possessions. Uh -huh. possessions. Uh -huh. Yeah, I think of possessions. Hey, do you remember that you have a lot of crudgeons or not? Yes, my yeah. my yes. yes. <laughs> my mother yes. put a, a, a how do you say seña in English? Because uh, the like, other like guys a little sign, like a little sign. sign. Uh, yeah, like, like a little sign. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's good. Or maybe just to identify, right? If this, those are yours or not. What about fish? Fish, pet. A pet. pet. Of a course, pet. right? It's gonna be pet. pet. Yeah, you used to have a, a fish. His name is Nemo. 
<laughs> what, a, what about play soccer? Hobbies. Hobbies, 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 of course. Hobby. Play soccer. Or in, in our case, guys, Pelegrina, right? Yeah. Jojo, Trumpo, right? Ule, like that. I Trump. remember those days. Yeah, that was good. What about play video games? Hobbies. Of hobbies. course, hobbies. right? Hobbies. hobbies. And I think some of you still play video games, right? Yep. Like I like who? Let me check. Like Frank. I remember mm -hmm. that. All righty. What about playground? You know what playground is? Places. Places. Play yeah. What Places. is playground? Places. Do you know what playground mm -hmm. is? Play the child. Uh, uh huh. Yeah, guys. Do you know that when you go to the um, any mall, right? Multiplaza, Las Cascadas, ex uh, Metro Centro, etc. Do you remember that there's always a place for the kids to play? Yep. Yeah. So that's yeah. what we call playground. Okay. Mm -hmm. When when is the kids area when they start uh, everything, uh, all the games and houses that they can use to play a lot of with other kids. <laughs> what about rabbit? A pet. Pet, 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 of pet. course. All right, last model. I have a uh, student. She had like a, I think one or two um, rabbits, like a pet. Very good. What about scrapbook? What is a scrapbook? Yeah, uh, I don't know. Any idea? Hobbies. Hobbies? A scrapbook, yes, it's hobby. Yeah, uh, already. Uh, I'm gonna give it to you um, an example of that. So let me just a couple of minutes. Uh, scrap book. Just okay, let's books. let's finish. Let's finish the um, the activities, and then I'm gonna share with you what is a scrap book. Summer camp. What is summer camp? Places. Maybe places, right? Summer camp. Places. Summer camp. And toys. Mm, possession. 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 Yeah. Of course. Toys. Alrighty. So let me share right now with you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A scrapbook. A scrapbook, yes. I'm going to share yeah. now with you, bear with me. It's... Scrapbook, all right. All right, let me check. A scrapbook. Scrapbook, I'm, I'm going to give it to you. Yeah, I will give it to you I'm right now. Me. All right, there you go. Reference. Let me share right now with you my... Reference. There you Reference. go, there you go. Where is he? Where is he? I have it here. There you go. I have it here, scrapbook. Reference. I'm going to share with you. Can you see it? the scrapbook? Yeah, do you can you get it? Do you receive it? Can you yeah. see it? Yes, yeah. I see it. Okay, so a scrapbook, guys, it's like we have a book and then we cut figures, right? Mm -hmm. Like pet, something that you like, and you just stick on it. Like Libro de Recortes, scrapbook. Yeah, so that is a scrapbook. Okay, guys. So, especially when we go to kindergarten, right? <laughs> All right, guys. So, now that we have any vocabulary, can you please let me know uh, what is exactly your possessions or which were your possessions when you were kids? Did you, did you have a scrapbook? No, or no? No, a scrapbook. No. I didn't, I didn't but, but I think, do you have a, did you have a comic book? Mm, comics, mm -hmm. yeah, like yeah. Spider Man, He Man, Superman, Superman. Pepito. Which one, Tian Janita? Pepito, Pepito you creo que, o no sé Pepito. cómo se llama. O Condorito. Condorito. <laughs> yeah, I don't oh, know. No. My five, my uh -huh. favorite was is a comics for Thor. <laughs> Thor, Thor, yay! I remember that. Also, there was the. The Phantom, remember? Yes. El Fantasma, the Phantom? The Phantom. Phantom. Yes. What was the other one? Ah, I remember yeah. that. Irving, Alejandro, Martita, I don't know, B. Hey, Bane. We're Hola. talking about uh, childhood memories, okay? I'm sorry. That's okay, no problem, but you joined to this class, yeah. which is cool. So do you remember the Phantom? What was all the Mandrake, right? The magician. Remember that? The Mandrake. Okay. Yeah, but I, but I think, guys, that there was like comics in the newspaper, right? Remember? Yes. Yeah, and, and some guys like caught it 
and then just put it in one book. What about guys possessions? Which possession do you have? You used to have. Trompo. I would have a big car collection. Bola. Really, car collection? Yeah, yep. that's great. Like Hot Wheel and Tonka. Really? Oh, that's great. Hey, what about guys? Do you remember that there was one one time when Coca Cola? I think Coca Cola was like giving like I don't know something to collect besides glasses. Besides glasses, they were like the locos. Like, uh huh. The locos. Yeah, locos. But there also were like mini cars. Remember mm -hmm. that? Do you remember that? Yes, I remember. Did, did you did you used to collect them or not? Mm -mm. Yeah, mm -mm. No, no, no. Oh, yeah. What else? What else? Only yellows. <laughs> Only yellows. All right. What else? Which other position did you have when you you when you used to be a child? I remember collect the latas. <laughs> cans. About cans. cans. Yeah. How uh, do you say chivola? Oh. Chivola. Canicas. Ball. Mm. Balls. Can little balls. Oh. Balls. Little balls. Little, little glass balls. Mm -hmm. Really? Ah, yes, to play like what is canicas? No, what was it? What was mm -hmm. it? Canicas. Yeah, canicas, canicas, right? Yeah, I remember the, the, the there was like a big one what they used to call chirolon, right? Like that. Chirolon. Yeah, yeah I remember yeah. that one. <laughs> that was oh, cool. Also, uh, um, uh, black black canicas with uh, much point and uh -huh. the number. Yeah, <laughs> was <laughs> sorry, Kakemiko. <laughs> really? I didn't know do, do that. Do you remember? Jorge? <laughs> <laughs> the, do you used to play like that, that Alex? Or no? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Oh, that's good. What about uh, Trompo? Right here in El Salvador, yeah. Trompo. And oh, Ule? So. Was the other one Ule, right? Um, uh, like Jojo, Capirucho. Right? Capirucho. Oh my God! You know what Capirucho? It was really hard because I hit my my fingers like trying to do like this. <laughs> yeah. The girls yeah. play a uh, jack. Yes, brave jacks. I remember that. Yeah. Yes. I used to like it. What else? What else, guys? Carlos played the uh, jacks. <laughs> it, there was something. There was something like you do like this, like taka 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 taka, triki traka, right? Triki traka. Yeah. Oh. That, yeah. Did you used to have that? That was on your possession. It's, it's, it's yeah. Paint. Yes, I have. <laughs> it was painting one with the taka taka taka. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That happened to me, Carlitos, for yeah. sure. Like I was like. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what about pets? Did you used to have pets when you were children? Uh, when oh, yeah. I was when I was children, I have a. a when you a were beard. a child. Yeah, yeah. One child, uh, bird, a bird. You used to have a bird. All yes. right. What about you, Alex? Um, um used to when I when when I shy, I have I, used I have, to have just I just I just had um a puppy. The name the name was mm -hmm. Snoopy. It's Snoopy. <clears throat> And you, and, you, and you are not Carlitos because you're supposed to be Charlie Brown, right? Yes. Yeah. And we're going to ask you, hey, where's Charlie Brown? What about Woodstock? Woodstock is the little bird. Remember? Yeah. The Snoopy's yes. Friend? Yeah. I don't but, remember. Yeah. But very yeah. good. What about you, Dinita? Did you used to have a pet? Or no? Uh, I don't have pets, but in the house of my mother, uh, I, uh, I, she have cats and i and one dog cats oh, and one dog four, four. so when you when four you cats. were a child living with her did you used to have pets yeah yeah? yeah 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 cats yeah. and dogs fantastic what about you mm -hmm. Jorjito? <laughs> what about mm -hmm. you Jorjito? what about you when you were a child um when i was a child i have a chicken a chicken and then when the chicken passed away, oh. I have a rabbit. Okay. And then when the rabbit passed away. When the rabbit passed away. Okay. <laughs> uh, we buy a you bought? parrot. But you bought a, 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 a what? A parrot? Parrot. Oh, okay, okay. And when the parrot passed away, you know, just give yep. I have a <laughs> I have a lot of pets. Really? 
A yep. lot of, but which one was your favorite? Uh, my favorite was a boxer. A boxer, I mean a dog. A dog. A dog. A dog. Oh, but he already passed away, or no? Yep. Oh. And then uh, he still have one, one dog. One parrot. One what Only. is his name? Yeah. Or her name? Perico. Oh my God, that's a pretty interesting <laughs> he name. He doesn't you know? have a name. No, come on. <laughs> really? Yeah. Uh, okay, that's oh, interesting. Jorge. That's interesting, uh -huh. right, Carlito? <laughs> Jorge, I, I, I remember <laughs> in my house, it's similar uh, the, the, the- Really? The, how do you say the similar chicken? Uh, about two or three, uh, weeks, uh, how uh, I I had a, a, a chicken. Uh -huh. So so my mother told me, uh, "Son, I'm sorry, but chicken is I really, mom. Yes, really. <laughs> Next to is the lunch, uh, a soup chicken. <laughs> I know." You know what? Yeah, yeah, I that's what I don't like because I, 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 don't, I don't want to what? like. What? I don't know. No, 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 no. I don't like that. No, if, if, the way you, 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 so you, so your mama George. killed the chicken and it was her lunch. <laughs> oh no way! You know what? That's why I, I, my sister, right now yes. there, she's like, uh, she has a lot of uh, little chickens and roosters and everything. She named one rooster Pichi. And she sent us a picture. Mm -hmm. And my mama and my grandfather and everything, he's like, oh my God, that rooster, it looks very nice. I think we can make them like in chicha. And my sister said, oh, no way. No way. You're not going to make pichi and chicha. No way. So everybody wants to eat the rooster. I was like, oh no. Yeah, you know what? <laughs> Uh, that that is what happened to one of my friends she lives in costa rica and her husband is from san, san miguel from el salvador and before the quarantine like a long, long time ago they came here to el salvador to uh her her husband's family right they, they live in san miguel so of course they have chicken they have hens they have rooster and everything and and uh, the auntie of his husband told her okay her name is Juanita. Her name is Paquita. Her name is, and all the hens have, had name, right? So they prepared hen soup that day. And she told my, my friend, today we're, we're, going to, we're going to eat a margarita, one of the hens. And she said, no way. Because I knew that poor little hen, gallina. So I didn't want to have lunch that day. Because mm -hmm. I met the hand that now is in the beach. So no oh. way. She said, you know what happened? I didn't have lunch that day. Sure. We just visited her. <laughs> and then we go, we came back to San Salvador and we passed to Pollo Campero to buy something because yeah. I didn't want to have margaritas uh -huh. for lunch. <laughs> and, yeah, of course. And that happens to me. If I know a pet and then I know that he's already on the plate on the menu, uh, no uh, way. I wouldn't eat it. Teacher. <laughs> yes, Alex. Uh, for this reason, it is not a good idea how a chicken spit. <laughs> yes, exactly. That's why. Because I, you know what? I, I, I cannot kill an animal just for eat. I can't. I can't. I'm going to cry for, with the animal. No, I can't. No, 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 no. I cannot even kill a, a chicken. Can you imagine? No way. It's not that I don't, that I cannot do it like I know how to do it, but I cannot do it because I don't know. I think I have a big heart for, for, for pets and for animals. I love the animal. I love all the animals. And since God, I have been lucky to know a lot of animals. I have been with dolphins. I have been with seals. I have been with giraffes, with lions, with parrots. Woo! Wow, most of the animals that I know. <laughs> yeah, so I, I'm lucky. And I love to like spend time in the nature. What about guys talking about nature? When you were kids, did you used to go to a specific place with your family? 
to spend vacations? I don't know. Uh, yes. Irving, yeah. Frankie, Bane, Bane. When you were a child, well, you still a baby girl, right? But I mean, when you were like five, six, seven, something like that, did you just to go to a specific place with your family? Like beach, I don't know. Los chorros, I don't know. I, I am remembered. You I still remember? remember? Wow. Remember. I don't remember. Come on, you're still really young. You can, <laughs> I, I can't say I don't remember because I'm older than you, but you're like 20 something. Give me uh, a moment, teacher. Okay, take your time. No rush. I don't think. <laughs> yes, <laughs> it smells like something is burning. I'm just kidding. <laughs> what about you, Frank? Okay, I'm going to give you a moment and then we're going to ask Frank. Frank, welcome to the jungle. Sorry, welcome to the class. Hey, Frank, we're talking about childhood memories. And right now we're talking about places that we used to visit when we were children like places that we used to go on vacation, for example, beaches, park, grandma's house. I don't know, just your imagination. So may I ask you, Frank, when you were a child, like that was not a long time ago, it was yesterday, right? Uh, <laughs> can you please let, me, let us know which places did you used to go on vacation or did you used to visit, even though it's not for vacation? Okay, when I was a child, uh, we're, we're going with my family to you used the, to go. you used to go to with my family to the safari shopping. <laughs> I don't oh, know. Really? What yeah, yeah, I know that. Uh -huh. Guatemala. Is yeah. that open? <laughs> and blue? Yeah. Yeah, it was incredible. It, it was very amazing for me because it was a child and all the things and all the animals are so big for me. And wow, <laughs> I feel like uh, with the dinosaurs, people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, have you visited the Safari Chapin, guys? No? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, it's really no, nice, right? What child. about you, Alex? Yes, teacher. Yes, yes, Nubi. Okay. What about you, uh, Irving, Ale, B? Have you visited Martita, the Safari Chapin? Mm. No? No. Yes, I, 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 yeah. I don't no. No, it's a place, guys. It is here and it is close to El Salvador. If you if you go from Acajutla, from Acajutla, yeah. it's nearby. Yeah, visit. You visit, but it's really hot. You cannot imagine. Yeah. Oof. <laughs> but I don't know I, how, how is is right now because I used to be in a safari shopping because I used to live in Guatemala from four years old until eight years old. But uh, I remember that was really nice place because, guys, you are inside your car and all the animals are like if you were in Africa, right? All the animals are in their own spaces. So you can watch the giraffe alive, the lions, tigers, the zebras. Ooh, it was really, really amazing. It's really nice. But I don't know now, maybe they have changed it because can you imagine? I was six years old the last time that I visited the Safari Chapin. I think now, Frank and Carlitos and Nubi, I think have changed a lot. I think so, I don't know, maybe, right? No, when I was a child, I visit, I used to visit the, the harbor, old harbor, the Acajutla. Really? Yeah, yes. in Hawaii. It's, it's very interesting because the, 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 the old harbor in this moment is just broken. Mm -hmm. the, the, but when I child, uh, it uh, wall and, and how do you say it's uh, uh, in the Duras? What is in the Dura in Spanish? What is it? Uh, entre las tablas hay un, un espacio. Oh, in between the, 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 the there are space, some spaces. Yes. Spaces. Uh, I, I, I watch, no, I, I see the ocean, the ocean, ah. and the, the different uh, boat. boats. Uh, oh. Boats, yes. Very interesting. Uh, yeah. Many, many people fishing to here. Uh, really? Are, the cañamo, um, how would you say, anzuel. Creek. I don't know. Hunk. Mm -hmm. Hunk. Exactly. Yeah, Hunk. Okay. It's very, very interesting. And so I visit the 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 harbor, the new harbor too. 
but the the, the a, a little little island I, I have a rock the name is Sacatillo. Wow, I remember. I, no, I have I haven't heard that. Uh, really? the, the new the new bar, the new harbor. Wow. Uh, the Sacatillo. In this moment, uh, the 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 words is very difficult. Difficult, uh, yeah. Difficult. Uh, when my father uh, remember. Uh, how do you say if uh, I I to go to the I went to the places? One minute, one one fish. One minute, one fish. One minute, one fish. Really? Uh, yeah. So there were a the lot of fishes there. Yes, the soldier told us you are uh, very interesting. Is good for the target shot target. Oops! Wow! My father and I and other people say uh, fishing. Uh, bye. See you. Oh my goodness! <laughs> really? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that was because... really nice. That's yes. a nice memory. Hey guys, what about besides Carlitos that he used to uh, visit the harbor? Uh, did you used to go to a specific place uh, when you were a child, like Los Chorros, or I don't know uh, what is the name of this I'm, one? I um, remember. What is the lake? What's the name of this lake? Well, I, I, will, I will remember. Guatepeque. but there is another one. There's another one. Ilopango. Ilopango. No. Okay. I remember We have. Uh, no, wait, wait, wait. wait. We, we need to give uh, the speech to Vanessa because if not, she's going to forget. Wait, yeah. go, ahead. go ahead, Vanessa. Uh, I was a child. Um, my father. Uh, we used to visit the Los Cobanos. Oh, Los Cobanos, yeah, yeah. Yes. Always, always used to visit Los Cobanos. That's amazing. It's beautiful beach. Yes, it is. I have been For there. <laughs> yes, yes, it is. It's really nice. It is one of the beaches that I like. Also, El Espino. Like that was oh. very. What about you? Well, she said Los Cobanos, right? That is a beach. Oh, I, I think it's near, like, it's in Sol Sonate, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, so I'm good in geography. Oof, very good. What about, <laughs> guys, other places? Thank you, Bonnie, that you used to visit. Like, um, Apanteos? I don't know, in Santa Ana, I think so. Yes, in Santa Ana. In Santa Ana, right? I think, I think it used to, it is like, um, uh, it used to be like uh, Los Chorros, right? <laughs> Similar. Or no, but more cold. <laughs> yeah, more cold, and they used to be like like a little fishes, which was biting your your mm -hmm. toes. Yeah, yeah. maybe yeah. a massage. Yes, yeah. like, like, like the panteos is a uh, old pool with create for yeah. some long time ago. Exactly. It's almost really? a, 50 or 60 years. <laughs> I May think I so. ask you, Frank, is still the pool uh, available or no? Yeah. Yes. All day. Oh All my day. God, that's nice. At 5 a.m. to 5 p.m. Wow. I thought, it, I, because I think that they create like a jail, right? Up on Taylor's jail. Yeah. So it's I near to jail. It's ah, near to jail. So I thought that because they created a jail they disappeared uh, that place but that's good if they don't that's amazing Ooh. so you see guys we have a really good childhood memories so when you're talking guys about your past about like this like the topic that we're used to, that we're using you're gonna use the word i used to i used to that means something that you used to collect, a place that you used to go, a hobbies that you used to have, but now you're already grown up and it's something different. And, and also guys, um, you can also use that phrase, I used to, when you're talking about your childhood memories, but also guys, for something, for some activities, uh, hobbies, uh, or food, anything that in the past, you used to eat music that you used to listen etc but now in the present it is something that you do not do anymore mm -hmm. for example or maybe behavior for example when you were a kid 
tell me something. All the kids have their rooms in order. Is that true or false? Todos false. los chicos tienen su cuarto en orden. Is that true or false? It's false. It's false, right? Everything is a completely disaster, right? But mama and, and, and daddy uh, like taught us, right? And uh, that we need to have everything in order. So uh, we could put a, we could use a sentence like this. I'm gonna share right now with you. Do, 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 do. There you go. This is what I want. There you go. A lot of things here. There you go. Mm -hmm. So let me let you know something. I will share right now with you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. For example, you can say like this. When I was a kid, comma, I used to be <laughs> very messy. Messy is means that it's a completely disaster. I'm gonna give you mm -hmm. two, another one. But now I'm very neat. Net, sorry. Okay, let me check. Mm -hmm. But now I'm very net. Ooh, there you go. Mm -hmm. Let me see here. I'm gonna need to like put some space here. There you go. Okay, I send you right now the, the sentence in the chat. In the what in the um, in the zoom chat and i said when i was a kid coma i used to be very messy that means that I, everything was cows in my room right everything was a completely disaster that was messy but now i'm very net that means that uh, i'm the opposite messy es que todo estaba desordenado y net es que tú eres alguien ordenado hoy right so in spanish is Cuando yo era un chico o un chiquillo o una chiquilla, yo solía ser un desastre. Very messy, right? Pero hoy soy muy ordenada. ¿Sí? ¿Me entienden yeah. lo que quiero decir? Yeah, very good, yeah. Yes. So, guys, uh -huh. entonces, I'm going to share right now with you guys some ideas about how we can uh, use the phrase used to to talk about different topics. And I want you guys to help me, uh, let me know which the ideas are positive and which were are negatives, right? So let me just around me just for a couple of minutes. There you go. Okay, I think I'm gonna put it a little bit bigger. I'm gonna share right now with you and let me know if you can see it. If you can't, that's good. If you can't, I'm gonna put it a little bit bigger. Is it okay right now, or would you like me to make a little bit bigger for you? Hmm. Is it much better now? Yeah? Yes, it's better. Yes. Okay, cool. Yes. All right, guys. So the first one is the one that I gave you. When I was a kid, I used to be very messy, but now I'm very net. May I ask you guys, this particular first sentence, which one do you think? Do you think is a uh, positive, or do you think is a negative way? Positive. 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 Yeah, it's positive. Very positive. good. What about the next one? Can you help me read it, uh, Jorjito, please? Number two. I didn't use to collect anything, but now, but now I do. Very good. So may I ask you, this is positive or negative? Negative. Oh, well, depends, right? Depends. Depends. Hey, but take a look at this, guys. Now that we're talking about used to, you see, when we when we uh, put when we uh, express affirmative sentence, you see that we only use used to, and then the verb. But if we're talking about negative, we're always going to use did or did not, and then. If you can used see, to. used to is going to be in present. Because, of course, you're you already using the auxiliary, right? It's something that we already know that. Okay, very good. What about number three? Dinita, can you please be so kind to read it for us? Okay. I never used to play a sport, but now I like to keep fit. Very good. What do you think? Is it positive or negative? Positive. Yeah, positive. exactly. Because now you need to keep fit. You know, you understand what is fit? Yeah? yeah, keep fit to be like 60, 60, 90, 60, right? 
All right. Oh, no, 90, 60, 90 is that. Okay, very good. What about number four, Carlitos? Number four. Number, sorry, number four, told me. Yes, please. I never used to worry about money, but I do now. Yeah, very good. Guys, do you remember that when you were a kid, do you used to worry about money? No. No, right? No, no you oh, were no. happy, right? If your Maybe father gave when, you uh, 10 cents, yeah. 25 cents, you said, I'm going to buy a Coke, I'm going to buy candies, I'm going to buy like this and this and this, mm -hmm. right? But now, guys, do, do you worry about money? <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah. Why? Because we have another responsibilities, right? We're right. parents, we need to pay bills, right? We need to go to the supermarket, etc. So... Let me ask you, this is positive or negative? Positive. And it's positive, right? Positive. Yeah, positive. because you are more conscious about it. Very yeah. good. What about number five? Who can help me read it? Frank, what about number five? Can you help me? Frank. Or are you taking calls right now? Frank, Frank, Frank. Oh, what? okay. I think Frank is busy. What about you? Frank, are you available? No. Okay, what about you, Alex? Okay. Uh, number five, I use I I used to have a lot of hobbies, but now I don't I don't have any free time. Yeah, what do you think? Is it positive or is it negative? Negative. Negative, negative oh. right? Uh, yeah, hey, yeah. yeah. I may I ask any. you, uh, do you guys, do you wish to have uh, more time for yourself and for your family sometimes? <sighs> yeah? Do you wish to have more time or no? Yeah. More time. Yeah. Yeah, I need right? more time. Yes. I think Brie needs more time to sleep, right, Brie? <laughs> Not teacher. <laughs> no. How how you guess teacher? Ah, very good. Yeah, guys. Uh, because for example, do you remember guys that when you were like uh, teenagers, you used to live in a in a neighborhood and you have your friends right in your neighborhood, and you used to go out and play soccer, play basketball. Am I right? But now, no, right? We don't have time. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and we I, have responsibility. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Yes, that's right. That's why we don't have any time, any free time, right? What about number six? And who can help me read it? What about you, Brie? Number six, please. Mm -hmm. Number six. Yes. I didn't use to follow politics, but mm -hmm. now I check headlines online every day. Very good. Do you think it's positive or negative? Negative. Positive. Yeah, positive or negative depends, right? Uh huh. Positive mm -hmm. because positive. because as a children, guys, you didn't care positive. about uh, what is changing in your country, right? Yeah. Yeah, but now as an adult, yes, because affect us. All righty, very good. Thank you, Bree. What about number seven? B. No Brie okay. anymore. I want B. Right. <laughs> okay. When I was younger, I used to care, care mm -hmm. a lot about my appearances. Appearance. Uh, now appearances. Oh, okay. Now I I am too be busy busy, mm -hmm. busy to care how I look. Very good. Uh, B, you're going to repeat the sentence and not because you didn't do it right. You did it good. You did it very good. But I want you to like try to read uh, more fluently. Okay. So let's use B, uh, the punctuation to, to help us uh, read a, a little bit fluently. So repeat after me. When I was younger. When I was, when younger, I was younger. I used to care a lot about my appearance. I used to, I used care, to a care a lot about, lot my, appearance. about my appearance. Now, 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 I'm too busy to care how I look. I'm too I'm busy too to care, busy how, to I look. care how, I look. how I look. How, how I, look. I look. Let's repeat something. When I was younger, only B, only B. When I was younger, 
when I was younger? I used to care a lot. I used to care a lot. About my appearance. About my appearance. Now. No. I'm too busy to care how I look. I'm too busy to care how I look. Very good. Now do me a favor. Now it's going to be only you. Can you please read it for me? Okay. Uh, when I was younger, I used to care. I used to care a lot about my appearances. Now I am too busy to care how I look. Uh, okay. Okay. Very good. Now let's repeat just this part, the last part. Now I'm too busy to care how I look. Do it again. No, I'm, I'm too busy to care how I, I look. Busy, busy. Busy. Exactly. Once again, now I'm too busy to care how I look. No, I'm too busy to care how I look. Very good. Ooh. Now do me a favor. Now it's going to be the last time, I promise. Well, that depends on you. I want you to read for me the whole sentence. You can do it, B. I know you can do it. <laughs> okay. Are you ready? Go ahead. Uh, when I was a, when I was younger, I used to care a lot about my appearance. Now I am look. I am uh, too. I'm sorry. I I don't read. You can I read am it. too busy to care how I look. Very good. Very good. Very good. Excellent. Yeah. Very good job. Thank you. B. Yeah, very good. You see that you could do it? Yeah, the first time you were like, like just, da -da 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 -da. but now the last time you were more fluent. As more as you practice, affluently you will get. But only guys, I wanna, I wanna let you know something. Um, let me see, let me see something. Yeah. <laughs> uh -huh. I wanna ask you something before we continue. Okay. I wrote to everybody. That is I am. Is that correct? Can you see on the chat, guys, on the Zoom chat? Yeah. yeah? I am. Is that correct? I'll I am. All know. right. Okay, guys. Listen. Uh-huh. Can I can I contract a am? Um, yeah. Um, um, the contraction um, is like that one, right? Um, I apostrophe M, right? I apostrophe okay. M, yes. Very good. You already know that. That's good. Very good. But guys, if you see I am, you got to say I am, which is correct. But if you if you see on a sentence or in an article or whatever, I apostrophe M, you know that apostrophe M is a contraction for am. You know that for sure. But I want you guys to pronounce it in a contraction way. So if you say I am, and it's going to be wrong because it's not am, it's apostrophe M. M. So you said I'm. 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 Okay. No, I am. I'm, I'm. I'm too busy to care how I look. I'm, I'm busy. too busy. I'm. I'm. I'm, busy. I'm too busy. You know that uh, apostrophe M is a contraction for I am. That's mm -hmm. yes, right. Yes. You're right. But when you see a, 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 a abbreviations, I want you guys to pronounce it in an abbreviation way. Okay. So that's, I know that is, we need to get used to it, but that's good. So guys, you see, I'm congratulations, everything, everybody. It's amazing. You did an excellent job. Good uh, work on pronunciation. All righty. Hey guys, I remember that I left you a homework. Is that correct? <laughs> yes. Mm, yeah. Think, I know. It, there yes. was like a you were going, you were supposed to answer to like six questions, I think, or more than six, about your last vacation. And you're supposed to create a paragraph. Yeah. Because we are we have seen um basically simple paths, right? We have seen simple paths. So I'm I'm gonna ask you if you can give me your vacations expectation or what did you do last weekend? Can I start with Dina, please? Ah! 
Yes, sorry, Dina. My last vacation. Yes, the homework. Okay. <laughs> yes, you gotta use everything that we have seen so far. Well, when in nineteen in twenty nineteen, uh -huh. I uh, this year like my vacation was iconic because este, we traveled with my son mm -hmm. to the United States Ooh. and we went to Washington, New York, and Maryland. Mm -hmm. uh, we went to the Hershey Park. Okay. And I and I remember uh, we ate a very a lot of chocolates <laughs> with my son. <laughs> uh, and uh, and visited to the Statue of Liberty. That Statue of Liberty, yes, I know that. And and uh, another place. And other places, for example. And other places. Uh, uh, Central Park. I knew it. Central uh, Park is iconic. I know that. Central Park. Uh, um, I know. The Empire State. Empire State. No. Empire State. Uh, we went when I, I was teenager, but my oh, yes, my sir. son no visited. Ah, uh, your and, your son didn't visit it. Okay. Okay. In in May, uh, with with my study group. We went to Spain, uh, visited Madrid. Oh, you went to the Real Madrid Stadium by any chance? I don't know. Ash, I don't know. <laughs> no, we would no, 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 no. You can, uh, you can, you can do it, you can do it. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, stayed 10 years in Seville. 10 days? And 10 days in Seville. Uh, and we we visited uh, Seta de Sevilla. We visited Cordoba, the mosque of Cordoba. Mm -hmm. uh, we went to the San Lucar de Barrameda, uh, uh, the caravels left to America. Oh, that's great. <laughs> Uh, have a, we have a, 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 a very time. A really great time. A great time. That's amazing. Anything else that yeah. you want to share or no? That's it. No, that's it. Okay, very good. So when you finish telling a story, you said, that's it. That means that's it. Yeah, okay. very good. Hey, that was Thank amazing. You. Now, Dinita, do me a favor. You can pick anybody from your classmates. And this is the next person that is going to talk about a uh, last vacation. Who you want to hear today? You can pick anybody else. You can pick Ale, Carlitos, Vanessa, Frank, Irving, B, Tania, Ale, Jorgito, anybody. Do you understand, Dinita? Yeah. Okay. But hurry up. What? Yeah, I, I, uh, I, I, I want I you to pick. I want you to pick the next student that is going to tell us his or her story. Oh. Mm -hmm. mm. Alex? I knew it. I don't know why. <laughs> okay, Alex. Sorry, but uh, you need your extra cup of coffee today. Go ahead. Okay. Um... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're the next one. <laughs> yes. George okay. One. Uh, on my last vacation, my family and I were busy to father wife. Uh, he he lives in Aguachapan City. Mm. Uh, my family and I lives in Santa Ana City, and I I drove during one um, one more or less one hours to. To the father uh, house and so your father-in-law house. Oh yeah, my my, my father-in-law. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. <laughs> uh, my daughters loved to this travel because she went uh, busy to co cousin Julie. The they played 
mm. um, all the morning and the after and after lunch they did continue play my wife did uh, did rest all the day and i was uh, happy for all but uh but i did tired our toes mm -hmm. yeah only that <laughs> when you finish it's like that's it i finish i finish <laughs> so you gotta say it, alex that's it that's it okay. very good <laughs> excellent great job and the last but not least alex ah carlos antonio i knew it go ahead <laughs> <laughs> okay my last vacation was uh, three years ago three years I, ago wow yeah. look at you yeah i went to i went out uh, with my dad to fish i was in april Oof. in the i <laughs> it was it's very hot the, the, the one uh, so uh, my father uh, uh, caught lobsters Really? And some, yes, um, about six or seven lobsters. Lobsters, and, wow. Yes, Delicious. and some some huge fish, uh, big fish. And I see there was a um, corgage too. The great catch I had was a fish about six centimeters. Really? Yeah. Uh, that was your big one. <laughs> Your daddy was like, yes, oh, my, my father is the expert. Shame on you, Shame on you, Johnny. I Come used on. The, the, the whole family loud, loud. <laughs> <laughs> I'm passed by a strange water because oh, I just said no. the, the net. Oh, uh, Ataraya, Ataraya, and yeah. nothing else. I'm it was sorry. very funny. <laughs> it was yes, funny. I can't even. We are laughing and we were not there. Can you imagine everybody? My, my, no. Yes, uh, uh, to, visit, to, to the visit the, the La Flores is next to the, uh -huh. the Los Cobanos. Oh, okay. Yes. Uh, in, this, in this moment, the how do you say Marea? Marea Baja. This is a long way, mm -hmm. A long way, okay. So uh, my father in the different rocks uh, 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 put a uh, ataraya mm -hmm. and six lobsters. Six lobsters six and lobsters. a huge fix. And yours were like this. <laughs> yes, yeah. I, I have only one fish to hear. Oh, I'm oh. sorry for that, Carlito. Yeah, oh, so, no. It was very fun. <laughs> yes, I can't imagine that. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. You know, you see, we did have been like a speaking activities, but we have learned how it's really important when we're talking about past things. We have used all, all that we have known so far. And also, guys, you have learned how to use used to, right? I used to. So if, if, you, if you notice, guys, in English, we have at least three ways to talk about past things. We have learned where to be in the past. We have learned auxiliary did. We have learned just no questions. We have learned all those questions. And now we're learning I used to. So there's many ways to talk about that. That's why, guys, I like English because it's so simple sometimes. Yeah. And you know what? If you notice, guys, in past simple, eh, there is no, um, like in present, like in present, for example, there is like a difference conjugation if you're talking about third person. But in simple past, everything is the same. Doesn't matter which uh, pronoun you're using. You're using I, he, she, it, we, you, they, and everything is the same. So that qual that's why it's called simple past because you don't complicate your life. So now guys, I want you to start using everything that we have learned so far, okay? And tomorrow we're gonna hear the rest of the guys about their vacations, but maybe I'm gonna ask you tomorrow guys, how was your day? And I want you guys to tell me or use everything that we have known. Okay. Any questions, any doubts? Now, and tomorrow we're going to play. Okay. 
because I, I it was really fun this I like this class you know I learned a lot from you guys and I remember the the lake that I didn't remember at the beginning of our conversation was Apulo Apulo do you remember Apulo Mm -hmm. yeah so that was the one some people used to go to a pool right to enjoy it i have visited a pool only one time in my life what about you jorgito no never what? alex what? carlitos Bane, alex irving v no 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 and you're salvadorians come on <laughs> <laughs> only the music Apulo, mama. The really? Beautiful. Is there a music about Apollo? Yeah. I didn't yeah, know that. It's, all music. Yeah. it's a cumbia. <laughs> cumbia. You know what? I'm going to search for that cumbia and I will try to listen today. <laughs> all right, guys. I know that you love me and I love you too, but you know what? Time is over. Time is over. Yay! Yeah. Ah, yeah, I'm sorry, right, Alex? I'm sorry. Oh my yeah. god. I'm, I'm gonna have my cup of coffee and my dinner tonight. Yay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, I'm so happy, guys, that I can see you one more time. This is the first class of our second week. So we're gonna have so much fun, but this week is gonna be a little bit harder than last week. Luna, okay. Yes. <laughs> I don't want to scare you, right? But we're going to start doing so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So please study everything that we have seen so far because tomorrow we're going to play, but at the same time, we're going to review everything that we have seen so far. Okay? Seen so far. Yeah. Right. Todo lo que hemos visto hasta ahorita. Everything that yeah. we have seen so far. Right? Okay, yeah. guys. So hugs and kisses. Have a great night, okay? Okay, teacher. Bye, take care. Okay. See you, see you, see you. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.